Lady Twix. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to the very first episode of a very long Dragon Age series that I plan on getting through, hopefully, before Dragon Age Dreadwolf appears. Um, kind of excited about getting back into Dragon Age. It's been a while since I've actually played it. It's been a few years, actually. I do remember the story. There are a lot of things about Dragon Age Origins that I don't remember, and it seems like every time I play... I find new little areas or new quests or something I missed before. So this should be interesting. Um, now I know there might be some people that have not seen the story. So for those who have played the game, let's be mindful of that. Yes, there are still people in 2024 who have not seen Dragon Age. So I hope that I can be somewhat entertaining. Also, I have a few mods, mostly aesthetics. In the game to kind of spruce it up a little bit because it is an old game i can't remember when it came out but it's old right so it needs just a little bit of help um so let's get right into it with a new game we're gonna play dragon age origins and we are definitely going to play awakening i'm gonna do a full playthrough of this all right let's get started and so is the golden city blackened. With each step you take in my hall, marvel at perfection, for it is fleeting. You have brought sin to heaven and doom upon all the world. Canticle of Threnodes, 18, 813. The Chantry teaches us that it is the hubris of men which brought the darkspawn into our world. The mages had sought to usurp heaven, but instead, they destroyed it. They were cast out, twisted and cursed by their own corruption. They returned as monsters, the first of the darkspawn. They became a blight upon the lands, unstoppable and relentless. The dwarven kingdoms were the first to fall, and from the deep roads, the dark spawn drove at us again and again until finally we neared annihilation. Until the Grey Wardens came. Men and women from every race, warriors and mages, barbarians and kings, the Grey Wardens sacrificed everything to stem the tide of darkness and prevailed. It has been four centuries since that victory, and we have kept our vigil. We have watched and waited for the Darkspawn to return. But those who once called us heroes have forgotten. We are few now, and our warnings have been ignored for too long. May even be too late, for I have seen with my own eyes what lies on the horizon. Maker, help us all. Indeed. 
All right, so we have seen some of the beginning lore of Dragon Age Origin. So um, the background you select will determine which of six distinct opening stories you may play through. It is. It also affects how characters respond to you throughout the game. So for those of you who haven't played any of these games, yes, your character, your character's race, your character's occupation, meaning the class, you have chosen affects how people are going to respond to you especially if you're like a mage um, mages are deemed very dangerous people fear them and elves so there is a bit of um racism i guess in this game i guess yeah it would be absolutely racism because elves are different races from humans so there is some slight racism even between from elves to human and human to elves. I see it more, it seems, on elves' behalf because of how they've been treated. But there's more to that story because I'm not quite sure about the entire lore of how all that happened. But it seems that it hints in Dragon Age Origins a little bit. And if we come across some books, I will try to... I don't want to do too much reading because it'll make for a very, very, very long series. But... I'll try to read some of them here and there. All right, so we're gonna keep it real simple. I'm gonna be a human, and I'm going to be, um, uh, do I wanna be a warrior? I don't wanna be a mage, because I don't like the gameplay of the mage in, in this particular series, or this particular, yeah, series, Dragon Age Origins. Okay, so I don't like how they play. I've never played a warrior, um, so that could be an option. Hmm. I tell you what, do we want to go warrior or do we want to go? Let's go, let's go what I feel is a little more realistic for how my character is going to play out. Um, so we're going to go human noble who's going to be a rogue. And all right, so born to wealth and power, second only to royalty, you find your training in both diplomacy and battle put to the test as your brother leads the bulk of your family's forces to war in the south. All right, greetings. So, I have downloaded some presets, and I'm gonna go ahead and create my character so you don't need to go through all of that. Um, rigmarole and watch me make my character even though I do have some presets I'm probably gonna try to change a few things around so I don't want to bore you with any of the details all right so we'll be right back greetings all right this is my character Natalia Kuslin she is the daughter of noble uh, nobles in Thetis so um I've made her wise, her voice wise, but I figured that's kind of her being wise. Um, okay, so we're going to go ahead and get her points established. Um, I did find out that willpower is still something that rogues use, but we're going to go ahead and give her a little bit of the on the constitution side, strength for sure, um, cunning, absolutely, dex, absolutely, and then we're going to put a little bit... Maybe another point into constitution. Kind of keep it a little, I don't know, it's not really even, but that's where I want it. The only thing I'm not gonna touch is magic. All right, so next. Um, so she's definitely going to be a maker of poisons, which makes sense. Mm, I think I'm gonna go with coercion first because reasons. And then, um, I, I think I want her to go into archery, so melee archer? Experience fighting in tight quarters has taught the archer to fire without interruption, even when beginning to, oh, I didn't know this. Okay, let's grab this just in case. Um, also lock picking because that's going to be important. All right, so we're gonna play this on no, normal. I was about to say noble. Let's go. For generations, your family, the Kuzlans, has stewarded the lands of Hyava, earning the loyalty of your people with justice and temperance. When your country was occupied by the Orlesian Empire, 
Your father and grandfather served the embattled kings of your land. Today, your elder brother takes up House Kuzlan's banner in service to the crown. Not against the men of Orlais, but against the bestial darkspawn rising in the south. I trust then that your troops will be here shortly. I expect they will start arriving tonight, and we can march tomorrow. I apologize for the delay, my lord. This is entirely my fault. No, no. The appearance of the Darkspawn in the South has us all scrambling, doesn't it? Mm. I only received the call from the King a few days ago myself. I'll send my eldest off with my men. You and I will ride tomorrow just like the old days. True. Though we both had less grey in our hair then. And we fought all lesions, not monsters. <laughs> At least the smell will be the same. Mm. I'm sorry, Pop, I didn't see you there. How? You remember my daughter? I see she's become a lovely young woman. Oh, dear. Pleased to see you again, my Pleased dear. Pleased to see you, darling. Okay, so um, right away, obviously, um, you probably recognize the actor's voice. I can't remember his name, but I'm just having a brain fart right now. So, all right. So, uh, let's see. He says, I'm pleased to see you, my dear. Um, and you... Carl, how? My son Thomas asked after you. Oops. Perhaps I should bring him with me next time. Hmm. To what end? I'd like that. I don't know. Should I? I should be. I do know that that would be the intention, but maybe not be rude. Good. My son saw you at a dinner in fair and has talked about you ever since. He'll be pleased you remember him. At any rate, Pop, I summoned you for a reason. While your brother and I are both away, I'm leaving you in charge of the castle. Okay. Um, I'll do my best, Father. Mm, are you certain what's involved with such a task? Yes, she would probably ask. Only a token force is remaining here, and you must keep peace in the region. You know what they say about mice when the cat is away, yes? There's also someone you must meet. Please. Show Duncan in. It is an honor to be a guest within your hall, Tyrn Coosland. Your Lordship, you didn't mention that a Grey Warden would be present. Duncan arrived just recently, unannounced. Is there a problem? Of course not. But a guest of this stature demands certain protocol. I am at a disadvantage. We rarely have the pleasure of seeing one in person, that's true. Pup, Brother Aldous taught you who the Grey Wardens are, I hope. Uh, yes, they are. He said they were snow. That is, they defeated the Darkspawn long ago. Not permanently, I fear. Without hmm. their warning of the Darkspawn rising now, half the nation could have been overrun before we'd had a chance to react. Duncan is looking for recruits before joining us and his fellow Wardens in the South. I believe he's got his eye on Sir Gilmore. If I might be so bold, I would suggest that your daughter is also an excellent candidate. Honor though that might be, this is my daughter we're talking about. Hmm. I have no interest in becoming a Great Warden. Absolutely not. I am not noble. Why would I want to? Do you hear that, Duncan? My daughter is not interested. So unless you intend to invoke the right of conscription, have no fear. While we need as many good recruits as we can find, I have no intention of forcing the issue. Pup, can you ensure that Duncan's requests are seen to while I'm gone? Absolutely. In the meantime, find Fergus and tell him to lead the troops to Ostagar ahead of me. I'm starting to rethink the, the preset because it looks so weird against the other characters and the hair. Okay, where's Fergus? Upstairs in his chambers, no doubt. Spending some last moments with his wife and my grandson. Be a good lass and do as I've asked. We'll talk soon. Okay. All right, so uh, tutorial, tactical view. The game can be played from a variety of tactical views. Use the mouse wheel to bring your camera down to explore. Uh, right click on your desired de destination. So, um, unpause. And she goes there. Okay. All right. So 
we can freely move about. So this isn't quite a um, point and click. All right. So can we finish talking? Yes. I'm sorry to bother you. How long have you and father been friends? We fought together under King Merrick when he drove the Orlesians out of Ferelden. Heady times. The years since have not held the same promise. It's not something a youth would understand. It will be good to ride beside your father again. Your son is interested in me. You knew King Merrick. I trust that a delay with your men is nothing serious. You knew King Merrick? Your father hasn't spoken of our time with him? That man took care of his friends. As they say, he was large as life and twice as tall. <laughs> it's too bad Kalen isn't half that. Mm. You don't think much of King Kalen. I think of him as much as he thinks at all. That's enough, Hal. You speak of our king. The girl did ask, your lordship. As per the latitude you allow, I merely offered my opinion. Hmm. Slimy. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's ask. Let's be. Let's be bold. The topic has come up from time to time. The young and their infatuations. Okay. Well, yes, I got the impression Thomas didn't like me. I'm sure that was years ago. People change. To be honest, I have no expectations. And your father seems determined to let you find your own way. If something did happen, well, we'd address it as befits a family of our stature. Hmm. He really is slimy. All right, well... Don't hold your breath. I'd like to see that. We'll see. I'm sure there will be much to discuss once I return. Yes. All right. Well, I should go. Oh, wait. No, I trust the delay with your men is nothing serious. Poor weather, I believe. Their progress has been slow, but it's nothing you need worry about. Mm-hmm. Um, you told my father the delay was your fault, of course. In a manner of speaking... If I had reinforced our border levies earlier, my troops could have left before the rains. I confess, my confidence in your father allowed me some complacency. I guess that makes it as much his fault. Hmm, okay. Well, I just want to wish you well, Arha. I thank you. That is quite unnecessary. All right, so, um, yes, tab is highlights everything that we can interact with. So let's look around. Is there anything else? Maybe we can talk to our dad before we go. Shouldn't you be off to your brother, as Ooh. I asked? Yes, are you sure you'll be all right? Your brother and I go into battle, not an afternoon tea. Who knows what will happen to us? Mm -hmm. I will tell you, however, you're my darling daughter. I love you. And I trust you completely to carry on the Kuzlin name if the worst should happen. But don't worry about me, dear girl. You'll have enough to occupy your mind while I'm gone. Of course. I'll go now. I'll talk to you soon. Just let me finish my meeting with Duncan. Okay. Um, I would speak to Duncan, but... All right. Okay. So, let's go ahead and go through this door. Check out... Hmm... Can we go this way? It shall be done. Lock picker. Anything in here I can loot? Yes. Green stone. Hmm. Don't see anything else. Let's go across here. I can't go through that door. Hmm. Doesn't look like. Oh, it's here. Okay, deep mushroom. I'm gonna take that. Oh, wait, wait. What is this? Oh, this is from the DLC. Okay. I was wondering, I'm like, what is that? I don't think I can use that. I think that's strictly for warriors. Um, we came through this door. Let's go down here. Definitely want to do some exploring first before I go talk to anybody else. Um, that's this is filthy. This is absolute filth. Go 
Good evening, my lady. Good evening. What's here? Very well. So, oh, it's plenty. I'm gonna say it's plenty, but it's just this one chest. Take that. Um, can I make anything? Now I don't remember the controls. Let's see. Inventory. So, how do I? I don't remember how to make. It. Oh, spread this out. Oh, I go. Yeah, it just goes that far. All right. So I can't make anything yet. Okay. And can I go through here? Yep. Let's see what's in here. Hello, everyone. At ease. As if she would say that. Okay. So, oh, there's some weirdness with the blocks. It might be because of... Oh, this is... This is where I came. All right, let's just go through this. Okay, let's just go through here. Oh, we can't jump. I forgot. I forget that you can't jump in this one. All right, let's go in here. It is begun. And so it has. Make that mace. I wonder if that mace is better than what I have now. Slightly. It's a main hand. Let's take it. Looks weird. Okay. Don't know if that's any... I better save... That is a firm reminder to save. And save often. Just in case. Alright, let's go up here. We're supposed to be looking for our brush. What's here? Oh, Ooh, boys. Lady, we were just... Uh... Mm, playing cards? Taking a break? Taking a break? Well, uh, well the treasury's safe. I'm not even sure why the Tern stationed us here. Mm. Don't worry about it, man. I won't say anything. Do you always question your duty? See, I don't think she... Would she? Did my father fear someone would steal something? That would be the wise decision. I don't know. Nobody has come to look at the treasury. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Continue your game. Pretend I never came by. Yeah. My lady is very kind to show us such lenience. Well, obviously, her father placed these guards here for a reason. Pretend I know nothing. Can I close this door? Yes. Oops. Not with me in it, though. Okay. Now can we close it? I, I don't. Do it. I don't know why I felt the need to close the door. All right. Let's get this off the, the screen because we don't need this. All right. Um. We can go. There oh. you are. Hi. Your mother told me the turn had summoned you, so I didn't want to interrupt. Okay. Mm Hello to you, Sir Gilmore. Uh, uh, pardon my abruptness, my lady. Sure. It's simply that I've been looking everywhere for you. I fear your hound has the kitchens in uproar once again. Oops. And is threatening to leave. Okay, well, did the dog get in the larder again? She was my nanny before she was the cook. Nan won't leave. Nan is just blowing off steam. She always been like that. So why look for me? Do something that's rude. The dog get in the larder again. No matter how the maids try to keep him out, he always finds a way in. You know these Mabari hounds. He'll listen to his mistress, but anyone else risks having an arm bitten off. Sure. He knows better to hurt anyone. Then I sh guess I should go collect. Yeah, maybe. That would be wise. Before Nan Looks tears like down the walls. You're quite lucky to have your own Mabari warhound, you know. Smart enough not to talk, my father used to say. <laughs> Of course, that means he's easily bored. Nan swears he confounds her just to amuse himself. At any rate, your mother would have me accompany you until the matter is settled. Of course. Shall we? We shall. Um, where is my mother exactly? She was entertaining Lady Landra and her son when I left her. Perhaps in the atrium? Uh, before we go, my lady, might I beg a question? I've heard from several people that a Grey Warden is here. Is that true? Yes, his name is Duncan. I met him. Then... Is it also true that this Grey Warden was asking after me? Uh... I'm not certain. Maybe? Was he? I think he did. I guess. Maker's breath. Are you certain? Can you imagine me, a Grey Warden? It would be everything I've dreamed of. Of course, I shouldn't get ahead of myself. Pardon my outburst. Sure. 
No problem. I. Okay. So, Sir Gilmore's become a part of my party. Let's um chat it up. With, let's see if we can loot anything first before we chat. No. Anything in here? Of anything? Book? New Codex: History of Ferelden, Chapter Two. Okay, I'm not gonna read all this, but these are codices. I'm not gonna read all these, but I think there's some more over here. Oh, is it on this side? Oh, what is over here? Oh, here. Chapter 1, History of Ferelden. Librarian, can we speak to you? Good evening. Mark. Good evening. Hello, hello. Okay, I think that's it. Let's go over here. We'll come back and chat. Another book. Doesn't look like there's anything else in here. Culture of Ferelden. I feel like that might be important, but okay. Well, maybe we'll maybe we'll do like an episode of reading. I don't know. We'll see. All right, let's chat with Aldous. Hello, my dear girl. Hello, hello. By chance, I am beginning to teach these young squires about your family's history. Uh, do we have to? History is boring. He has Boys, a deep you voice. You are referring to the Kuslans. The very family in whose castle you live, show some respect. This little boy has a deep voice for being so young. Okay, um, still the same taskmaster, I see. I don't want to say that. It could do with some discipline. <laughs> it's alright, it is boring. It is boring. Let's just be honest. I see you haven't changed. Mm -mm. Perhaps it would benefit you to join our lesson. Uh-huh. Okay. Um, sure. Why not? Okay. Certainly I'd be happy to. Wonderful. Oh, the Coosland history is long indeed. Where shall we start? From the beginning. Um, when was our line founded? Well, records are vague. But the Kuslans became Tians during the Black Age. Is that familiar, child? Um, during the like lycanthrope plagues? Is this like werewolves? Good. I'm pleased some of my lessons seem to have stuck. Mm -hmm. At that time, your family held only the minor title of Ban. Ooh, I don't like when that. When werewolves reached this area, Ban Mather Kusland organized a curfew and patrols within the city. Several other local bands supported his efforts by swearing oaths of fealty, making him their turn. Mm hmm Okay. Uh, we predate the founding of the kingdom, yes? Well, I'm glad some of my lessons don't disappear into that yawning chasm between your ears, young lady. I'm not a complete ninny. Um, it's your skill as a tutor, of course. If I were truly a skilled tutor, I suspect I would not encounter such insouciance amongst my pupils. You can look that up later. Yikes. At any rate, your family has held the tournier of High Ever since before King Callan had united Ferelden. In fact, Tierna Elethea Kuslan battled Callan had to maintain High Ever's independence. And Callan had let us keep the Tyrn. Galanad wished to unite Ferelden, not conquer it. After Elethea's men were defeated, Galanad asked her to swear fealty. The boulder where they held council still stands today as a memorial of that event. Okay. So, we oppose the king? Well, the Kuslans are ardent royalists now, but at that time, Galanad was unknown and considered dangerous by many. When Callanhad's army reached High Ever, Tierna Elethea led the local bands against him. Obviously, Callanhad won. Okay. Tell us, tell me, or tell us, about our relationship with Earl Hal. The history between the Kuslans and the Howls reaches back to the Orlesian occupation. And where did Orle occupy? When did Orle occupy, however? During your grandfather's rule. Of course, Orlais found it difficult to hold these lands. 
During the rebellion against Orlay, several battles were fought near Hyever. The port village of Harpers Ford was the Turnier's center. Its arl was Tarleton Howe. Though nearly 90, he was still as sharp and bitter as cheap ale. Your grandfather openly supported the rebellion, but how sided with Orlay? Your family was forced to seize Harper's Ford before it was all over. This man back here is like me sometimes trying to look busy. He has paced back and forth and been looking at the same bit of shelf for the last five minutes. The man is not working. He's just looking busy. Okay. Um, but we fought. Mm, but our father in our 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 how I cannot say that our old friends the house eventually joined the rebellion when all of Ferelden united behind King Merrick and General Loghain just as now we united behind Merrick's son King Kalen mm -hmm. to fight the dark spawn okay time to end the lesson I think oh, thank you for indulging an old man of course. Oh, does that mean we have to listen to you now? Silence. Really? I will not have you two becoming smart mouthed hooligans. But perhaps you should go. I doubt they need any more distraction. I'm just going to settle in here and apparently just talk to myself. <laughs> <laughs> he has had it. He has had it. Oh my gosh. He has absolutely had it. All right. Come on, Sir Gilmore. Thanks Good for evening, my lady. Good evening. Okay, so that is Mom and some people. We need to go to the kitchen first, right? In here. Anything? Anything good? I didn't see anything. Yeah, I didn't see anything. Okay. That looks creepy. Good evening, my lady. Hello. Is that? Yeah. Oh dear. Okay. Get that bloody mutt out of the larder. But mistress, it won't let us near. If I can't get into that larder, I'll skin both of you useless elves. I swear it. Uh, calm down, good woman. We've come to help. You and you. Your bloody mongrel keeps getting into my larder. That beast should be put down. Okay, so... Mm... I'm not sure. I realize that she has been around and there's a relationship between Natalia and her that must be fairly strong. But I really did not like the way she talked to those elves. And I am like so close to saying something like this. Maybe you should be put down. Um, he's not a mongrel. He's a pure blood Mabari. I'm sorry. He's, I'll be, I will be polite Considering my upbringing, I'm sorry he's bothering you now. Just get him gone. I've enough to worry about with a castle full of hungry soldiers. You two, stop standing there like idiots. Get out of the way. She is demanding. My word. Okay. To equip new items, you need to open the inventory screen. Do so now by clicking on the highlighted icon or pressing I. Okay, so up here, I'm just going to press I. Mm, look at this real quick. Main menu. Oh, skills is K. Okay. Spells and talents, P. Okay. All right, so we've got new equipment. We do? What am I supposed to do? Okay. Oh, like drag this to... The, the, the bar. Okay. Actually, I think I want to move this like right here. Okay. Now what? Is that it? Okay. All right. Let's go in here because he's driving me insane. Well, look at your puppy. He's so cute. Oh, look at that mess. How did he even get in here? Look at your little tail. He looks like a pit bull on steroids. Like a, a bully. Not a American Terrier pit, but a bully. Enough, you're a bad boy. Do you hear me? What a smart boy you are. Oh, yes, you are. 
Sit right there. I'm not putting up with this. Are you trying to tell me something, boy? I think she would ask that because Mabaris are very smart. They don't just bark for no reason. It does seem like he's trying to tell you something. Oh, I hate this Wait. little spot here. Did you hear that? Enter a name for the dog. Ugh. Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> Let's see. I'm going to name him Augie. So now we have a rat -a -tet, tet So what is it saying? You are in combat situation. That is so little. All right, let's go. So we're just going to go for it. Get these beasts out of here. Don't give them Watch out, they might bite. They're huge. <laughs> Giant rats. It's like the start of every bad adventure tale my grandfather used to tell. Your hound must have chased them in through their holes. Ugh. Looks like he wasn't raiding the larder after all. It certainly looks that way. Those were very large rats. I've seen larger. <laughs> they come up from the Kakari wilds sometimes. But seeing as you've got your Mabari well in hand, I'll be on my way. I'm to prepare for the arrival of more of the Isle's men. This is gross. Who's going to clean this up? Take that. Wooden crate. We'll take that. Anything else in here? Good puppies. Um, do you see anything interesting? Yes, he brought me an item. What did he bring me? Item received. What? Another green stone? Some deep mushroom? Okay. I guess. I don't know. All right, let's uh, talk to Nan. There he is, as brazen as you please, licking his chops after helping himself to the roast, no doubt. Did you not hear those giant rats in there? I mean, actually, he was defending your larder from rats. Big ones. What? Rats? Not the large grey ones. They'll rip you to shreds, they will! See, now you've gone and scared the servants. I expect those filthy things are dead. It's never enough with her. It's never enough. Yes, the rats are dead. It's quite a mess, in fact. Oh, I bet that dog led those rats into there to begin with. Really? I know. Oh, don't even start with the sad eyes. I'm immune to your so-called charms. Dog is more charming than you. Here, then. Take these port bits and don't say that Nan never gives you anything. Bloody dog. Nan gives you a hard time. Thank you, my lady. Now we can get to work. That's right, you two. Quit standing about. Oh, she is a bossy. There's no way I'd be able to work for her. I'm serious. Absolutely not. It is begun. All right. Oh, we've got a kitty cat. Can I pet the kitty? Nope, can't pet the kitty. Very well. Take all the deep mushrooms I can get. Iron ring. Is that a thing? Is that something to wear? It's just a regular old ring. Let's put it on just for GP. General purposes. Okay. So now we need to find mother. She was over here. Did we look? Did we look in here? Oh, we did. Yeah, this is the library. All right. You rang. And my dear Bryce bought this back from Orlay last year. The Marquis who gave it to him was drunk, I understand, and mistook Bryce for the king. Ah, here is my lovely daughter. Hey, Mom. I take it by the presence of that troublesome hound of yours that the situation in the kitchen is handled? So there's one thing that I can point out. Obviously, there's a difference in skin color. I... I realize that maybe they didn't have the technology back then. I'm not sure to make your parents look more like you when you choose a different skin color. Um, which whatever we're gonna just, we're gonna keep it pushing, but there's obviously a different, obviously a difference. But just so you know, just just in case you didn't you didn't notice. All right, yes, mother, Nana's back to work as we speak. Yes, there was. I don't want to say that in front of company. 
Um, yes, mother. You've always had a way with her. Darling, you remember Lady Landra, Ban Lawrence's wife? I think we last met at your mother's spring salon. Mm, yes, it's good to see you again, my lady. You're too kind, dear girl. Didn't I spend half the salon trying to convince you to marry my son? And made a very poor case for it, I might add. You remember my son, Dairon. He's not married yet, either. Don't listen to her. It's good to see you again, milady. You're looking as beautiful as ever. Mm. Thank you, you flatterer. Go so <laughs> Um, okay. Um. You flatterer. Thank you. You're looking handsome yourself. Is she forward? Is she how would she dare? Mm, maybe. Maybe not. I, I would say yes. And this is my lady in waiting, Iona. Hello, Iona. You say something, dear. It is a great pleasure, my lady. You are as pretty as your mother describes. You would think that it would make it easier to make a match for her, not more difficult. Perhaps your daughter simply has a mind of her own, your ladyship. You should be proud. Proud doesn't get me any more grandchildren. Yeah, you sound like my mom. <sighs> May I go now, Mother? I'm getting bored with this conversation. Um, May I go now, Mother? Of course, darling. You must have many things to do before Fergus and your father leave. I think perhaps I shall rest now, my dear. Dairon, I will see you and Iona at supper. Perhaps we'll retire to the study for now. Good evening, your ladyship. Good evening. Okay, can I speak to Mother? You should say goodbye to Fergus while you have the chance. Mm, I think the purple eyeshadow was a mistake. It seemed okay at the beginning, but... Um, you're right, I should go. Do you know there's a Grey Ward in here? Yes, your father mentioned that. You haven't got it into your head that you want to be recruited. Mm -mm -mm. No, no, definitely not. Keep it that way. You've enough to do here at the castle without chasing Darkspawn. Hmm. I have a bad feeling about all of this. As do I. Your father and brother are marching off to fight the Maker knows what. All the assurances in the world don't comfort me. But it wouldn't help for us to take up arms and follow. Fergus and your father have their duty and we have ours. Okay. Um, are you staying at the castle? For a few days. Then I'll travel with Lady Landra to her estate and keep her company for a time. Your father thinks my presence here might undermine your authority. Hmm. As you wish. Good. I was worried you might be nervous about running the castle alone. I needn't have been concerned. Um, do you know where Fergus might be? If he's not out with his men, probably upstairs with Oriana. Okay. I should go. I love you, my darling girl. You know that, don't you? Hmm. I love you too. Go do what you must then. I will see you soon. Okay. So, all right. I was going to ask the last question about should I, uh, why can't I go with Fergus and father? But I feel like she wouldn't ask. She knows her duty and she has been told to stay behind to make sure that the Kuslin's, um land is well taken care of, I guess. So their empire, so to speak. There's nothing in here to raid. To raid? To loot. Good evening, my lady. Good evening. All right, so we're going to head in. This is this, this, a. This door looks different from the other ones, yeah? Oh, they all kind of do. All right. Um, what's over here? Okay, that's that. Let's go explore here first before we talk to. I, the family? Yeah. I keep hitting the mic. Sorry about that. Okay, I can't go in here. And I say. can't see. Oh, can I? No. Okay. All right, so we don't have any place to go except right here. Is there really going to be a war, Papa? Will you bring me back a sword? That sword, Oren. And I'll get you the mightiest one I can find, I promise. 
I'll be back before you know it. I love his name, Orin. I wish Orin. victory was indeed so certain. My heart is disquiet. Don't frighten the boy, love. I speak the truth. And here's my little sister to see me off. Now dry your eyes, love, and wish me well. Your little sister has a serious tan. <laughs> I probably should have lightened her up a little bit. Because I, I didn't, I wasn't thinking. Whatever. <laughs> We're going to go with that. Um, should I wait outside? Stay. I'd like to say farewell. Mm. Okay. Um, I bring a message. Father wants you to leave without him. Then the Owl's men are delayed. You'd think his men were all walking backwards. Really hate this Well, spot. I'd better get underway. So many darks born to be ahead. So little time. Off we go then. I'll see you soon, my love. He says it so casually. I would hope, dear boy, that you plan to wait for us before taking your leave. Be well, my son. I will pray for your safety every day you are gone. Mm, okay. Uh, Fergus will be fined. I keep telling fined? you, no dark sport will ever best me. The Maker sustain and preserve us all. Watch over our sons, husbands and fathers and bring them safely back to us. And bring us some ale and wenches while you're at it. Uh, for the men, of course. Fergus, you would say this in front of your mother? What's a wench? Is that what you pull on to get the bucket out of the well? A wench is a woman that pours the ale in a tavern, Oren. Or a woman who drinks a lot of ale. Bryce, make us breath. It's like living with a pair of small boys. Thankfully, I have a daughter. Mm -hmm. I'll miss you, mother dear. You'll take care of her, sister, won't you? Of course. You can count on me. Oh, good. How thrilling to know I'm so well taken care of. <laughs> enough. <laughs> enough. Pup, you'll want to get an early night. You've much to do tomorrow. Yes. Indeed. Okay. I love the transition. He stares at the door and growls. Okay, what's wrong, boy? Is someone out there? Of course there is. My lady, help me! The castle is under attack! More enemies ahead! Am I gonna fight them in my skivvies? It Blast! Quickly! We must fight! It is begun. I am. Okay, no. Can I just, yeah, let's, <laughs> let's put some stuff on. Oh. Can I not? Okay, yes. Now, there we go. It is begun. I shall do it. It is begun. As you see. It is begun. It shall be done. Are these my enemies? Where yep. Is the tan? Tell what? As you say. What? It shall be done. Why would I tell you where my dad is? It shall be done. It is begun. Darling, I heard fighting outside and I feared the worst. Are you hurt? Mm, I'm fine. What's going on? Her scream woke me up. There were men in the hall, so I barred the door. Did you see their shields? Those are Howl's men. I did. Why would they attack us? I don't know. Um, I don't know, Mother. But he betrays... I Would she know that? 
would she know that? I don't think so because they were asking for the Tyrn. But oh wait, the troops are gone, so they haven't left yet. So he's betrayed, Father. You don't think Hal's men were delayed? On purpose? I absolutely do. Bastard. I'll cut his lying throat myself. Have you seen your father? He never came to bed. No, I haven't. I was in my room. We must find him. Okay, um... It sounds like we should check on Oriana and Oren, yes. And dress his mercy. What if the soldiers went into your brother's room first? Let's check on them quickly. Then we'll look for Bryce downstairs. Okay, but first let me loot the bodies, you know. Oh, every time you gain a level, your character gains new abilities and an improved statistics. Left click on the plus button next to your character's portrait to level up. So both of us have leveled up, myself and my dog. So we're going to go ahead and give myself a little bit more constitution, a little more action, please. All right. Sorry. Um, willpower, magic. Nope. Cunning, strength, a little more strength and a little more cunning. Um, do I want more coercion? We're in Rose gain access to second tier weapon talents as well as a bonus to stamina region. Mages can take more damage from an attack. If we're interrupts or spell casting and gain a bonus to mana regen. So let's go ahead and take that. I do want to work on this too. I'm not sure if I want to go into traps. Mm. Lock picking. Do I, do I want? Oh, that's level four. So I better to get some weapons training in daggers because I don't have a bow right now. So let's go with dual sweep. Um, unless I did I loot a bow? I did not. Okay, maybe I'll find one here or something. It is begun. And there's a bow. Okay, so this guy. All right, let's go in here. Very well. There's a trap here. Um, anything else in here that's of use? No. All right, can we go in here now? Oh no. No, my little Oren. What manner of fiend slaughters innocence? I will make them pay. Don't look, mother. It's too late. She's already looked. I will make them pay. How is not even taking hostages? He means to kill all of us. Oh, poor fuckers. Let's go. I don't want to see this. I don't want you to see this. Okay. Um. Was I in there? I don't think so. Perhaps we can salvage some things here, Doc. Very well. Oh, there's there's a lot in here. Some okay. of your father's belongings are in that trunk. Oh, this is their room. Okay. Um. So let's see. Let's look at weapons. I can't use this. Okay. So short elm, short bow elm, long bow. Probably slower. Range 35, 20, shrimp modifier. Let's just put this on. I think this is going to be our main way of attacking. So the secondary would be the melee daggers. So wait, how do I switch? Oh, I didn't level up my dog. Let's go back. Oh, wait, let's go back, level up our dog, give him some more constitution, some more strength. Do I, I guess I can give him, do I need to give him dexterity? He's a warrior, so would he, would he? Mm -mm. Dexterity is the measure of agility, reflexes, and balance. Higher dexterity improves a character's chance to hit. 
makes the characters more likely to dodge incoming blows and contributes to the damage dealt by piercing weapons like daggers or arrows. So would that be a good stat for a warrior? The willpower would. Let's go here. Okay. All right. Let's go. Actually, let me save. Because I know how these games can get. All right. So no need to look at. Oh, oh, wait. Oh, yeah. I already. Oh, is my mother like. Oh, she doesn't have anything. Ooh, mother, I'm sorry. I didn't give you not one bit of weapons. <laughs> not one. I didn't even check. All right, let's give her. I think she's good with bows, right? And just in case, we'll give her two daggers. Just in, you know, just in case, just in case. But bow will be her main. Actually, can I give her the mace? As a main hand as well. All right. Um, yeah, let's give her a ring. Let's pretend like that's her wedding ring or something. Why not? All right. Take this. Um, this is where we are headed. Oh, oh, as you say, oh, dear Landra. I'm I'm so sorry. Mm. If she hadn't come to me, if she hadn't been here, it's not your fault. It's not your fault. Okay. I love how I'm in such a hurry that I have time to loot. Wait, I one more door. Okay, wait. Okay, this is the way to go. Can you hear the fighting? Hal's men must be everywhere. Then we take the fight to them. How can we get out of the castle? The servants' passage leads out from the larder. But we must find your father first. The front gates. That's where your father must be. Okay. Um. Is there nothing else we can do? I have my treasury key. We could go there first and take the Kuslan sword from the vault. If anything is worth fighting to keep out of Hal's hands, it's that sword. But it may be a dangerous path. That's it? We can just let Hal win? Listen, darling. We haven't much time. If we can't find your father, you must get out of here alive. Without you and Fergus, the entire Kusin line dies here. If Hal's men are inside, they must already control the castle. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let's use the servant's entry in the larder to escape. Do you hear me? Yes, I hear you. Um, <clears throat> I want him dead. You don't need to tell me twice. Then let us be swift. Let's worry about getting the family out first, and then we'll figure the revenge part later. Another short bow. <clears throat> um, I think that's it. Yeah. Excuse me. My allergies are kicking in today, guys. Sorry. All right. The castle has fallen. I'm getting out of here. Okay. Don't be a coward, stand and fight. Yes, my lady. Here, here they come. Maybe I should switch to melee because my mother. Oh, you. Uh, 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 away with you. you know what? Let me switch to melee. It is begun. As you say. Let's assist him because he obviously needs help. I shall do it. I shall do it. Be wary. There is no glory in bloodshed. 
It shall be done. Oh gosh. Ah! Come on, hands. Oh dear. Very well. Watch out. It is the gun. As you say. I died. I died. We will not be defeated. If that is what you wish. I wasn't paying attention. You wish. The Kusans will not fall to the likes of you. Oh, that's her, um... You're all dog meat, that's what. She died. All right, it's up to you, Augie. Okay, don't die on me. Does he have anything? Why would he have anything? I'm gonna die. Why am I? Oh, I forgot. Pause. Get him, monsters. Don't let us go down like this. <laughs> All right. Loot. All right, you guys can get up now. Me too. Me too. All right. Um. Let's uh. Let's not do that again. We're getting close to the treasury. The Kuzlan family blade lies inside. Use that key I gave you. Okay. That blade cannot fall into Hal's hands. Go in here. Oh, the guards are dead. Okay. So this is where the treasure... It is begun. Very I mean, well. A treasure trove. Um, it shall be done. So we've got scale armor and the shield. As you say. We've got another short bow and an axe. We'll look at that. Is this the family sword and the shield of high ever? All right, so let's sort out. <clears throat> this is probably main hand, so I'll take that. Anything what about this axe? Is this better? Just a main hand. Okay. Um, what about? Gear. I cannot use this. Can mother use this? She can. Maybe give her some more gear. She's stronger than I am. All right. <clears throat> all right. Let's go. I think that's all I need. You know what? Just in case. Um, let me give her. She has. Does she have any potion? She have any potions? Let's give her some potions because I didn't have anything. We share inventory, so I don't even know why I didn't think to give her any. any oh, hello. Not today. Not again. Okay, I'm moving out the way. I have Augie. Did I lose my guy? You gave me no choice. I did. He died. I lost my guy. Okay. Salute him. I shall do it. All right. This way? Nice. Anything in here? Oh, my... He will be avenged, old sage. I swear it. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, he means to take no prisoners. So my life is in danger as well as my parents. I don't need any lyrium, but I'll take it. All right. You know what, Augie? How about you? How about you? Can I, like... Not scroll out. Okay, here we go. You attack this guy. And 
mother. She's attacking over there, so let me look in this guy. I shall do it. Oh no, you don't. As you say. I shall do it. They are wiping us out. Okay. I have not saved not one person. I said the last time. Another blank fell on. I don't know what those are for. So we can't go that way. And you're back. As you say. It's begun. It's begun. As you say. As you say. Come and face me if you dare. Oh gosh. We must stop them. It is begun. I shall go. How dare you come here? Ooh. Well, he's dead, dead. No chance from coming back from that. Or no chance of coming back from that. Okay, we already went in there, so let's go this way. This is the only way we can go. Already check this room. Let's go in here, then. Okay, this is amazing. Disgusting critters. How dare you? Yes. Oh, shoot. Uh-uh. Get the mage. Get the mage. Get the mage. Am I probably missing? Oh, jeez. I'm glad I don't have the camera on. Go, man the gates. Keep those bastards out as long as you can. The way my mouth drops. <laughs> my lady, you're both alive. I was certain how's men had gotten through. Did you see that beam she shot out of her hand? Okay. They did get through. The, how that treacherous bastard. When I realized what was happening, it was all I could do to shut the gates. But they won't keep Hausman out long. If you've another way out of the castle, use it quickly. Okay. Um, we need to find Father. When I last saw the turn, he'd been badly wounded. I urged him not to go, but he was determined to find you. He went towards the kitchen. I believe he thought to find you at the servant's exit in the larder. Okay. Bless you, Sir Gilmore. Make her watch over you. Make her watch over us all. All right, let's loot. Clear out. Give us a mage. I shall do it. Um... I don't know, you guys. They seem kind of weak behind that door. You might be able to hold them. So, is that it? Nope. Yes. Okay. Two against one. That's not fair. I shall do it. I must drive you from our land myself. How dare you? It shall be done. Right away. That is what you wish. Am I? We have won this battle, but we cannot waste more time. We saved one soldier. Actually, we saved more than that, but still. All right, what's in we here? Must get out. We must get out. Everyone. They're slaughtering everyone. Oh yeah, go run. I shall do it. Get out of here. Uh, this way. Is this the only way? Yes. I think this is the kitchen. Oh no, sorry. As you say, 
very well. I'm gonna rip you a new one. Did he just say he's gonna rip me a new one? I am armed. I can't. The camera. Oh, that's an actual soldier. Okay, so where do I need to go? I'm obviously not in the right area. Let's see. Let's look at the map. So I've been in here. Where am I supposed to go? This way? This way. It is the gun. That soldier is a tank. He has survived. What's in here? No, okay, that's... Did I? Oh, is that the... Oh, no. Are those those two from earlier? It is. Oh, my gosh. This is the kitchen. And no, these are. Oh, there's Nan. <gasps> I've never noticed that. As you say. Also, I don't think I've ever noticed that we actually win the larder. There, you both are. I was. Right. Wondering. When you would get here. Mm, dear. Maker's blood, what's happening? You're bleeding. Hal's men found me first. Almost did me in right there. Mm. We need to get you out of here. I... I won't survive the standing, I think. <laughs> then we will stay and defend you. Once Hal's men break through the gate, they will find us. We must go. Someone must reach Burgess. Tell him what has happened. I must have planned something for him, too. Bryce, no. The servant's passage is right here. We can flee together, find you healing magic. The castle is surrounded. I cannot make it. I'm afraid the turn is correct. Hal's men have not yet discovered this exit. But they surround the castle. Getting past will be difficult. You are Duncan, then? The Grey Warden? Yes, your ladyship. The turn and I tried to reach you sooner. My daughter helped me get here. Make her be praised. I am not surprised. Hmm. Thank you for saving my father. I fear your thanks are premature. I doubt I have saved him. Whatever is to be done now, it must be quick. They are coming. Duncan! I beg you, take my wife and daughter to safety. I will, your lordship, but I fear I must ask for something in return. Anything. What is happening here pales in comparison to the evil now loose in this world. I came to your castle seeking a recruit. The Darkspawn threat demands that I leave with one. I... I understand. No, I won't agree to such a thing. Then what else? How will you survive? I will take the Tirna and your daughter to Ostagar to tell Fergus and the King what happened. Then your daughter joins yeah, the Grey Wardens. So long as justice comes to Hal. I agree. Then I offer you a place within the Grey Wardens. Fight with us. Very well. I accept your offer. 
We must leave quickly then. Bryce, are you sure? Our daughter will not die of Howe's treachery. She will live and make her mark on the world. Darling, go with Duncan. You have a better chance to escape without me. Eleanor. Hush, Bryce. I'll kill every bastard that comes through that door to buy them time. But I won't abandon you. Mother, are you sure you want to do this? My place is with your father. At his side, to death and beyond. I'm so sorry it's come to this, my love. Oh my we gosh. had a good life and did all we could. It's up to our children now. Then go, pup. Warn your brother. And know that we love you both. You do us proud. They've broken through the gates. We must go now. Goodbye, darling. This is the saddest, the saddest scene I've seen in a, a long time. We will be traveling south through the hinterlands to the ruin of Ostagar on the edges of the Korkari Wilds. The Tevinter Imperium built Ostagar long ago to prevent the Wilders from invading the northern lowlands. It's fitting we make our stand here, even if we face a different foe within that forest. The King's forces have clashed with the Darkspawn several times, but here is where the bulk of the Horde will show itself. There are only a few Grey Wardens within Ferelden at the moment, but all of us are here. This blight must be stopped, here and now. If it spreads to the north, Ferelden will fall. Ho there, Duncan! King Caelan! I didn't expect a... A royal welcome? I was beginning to worry you'd miss all the fun. Not if I could help it, your majesty. Then I'll have the mighty Duncan at my side in battle after all. Glorious. I love the reflection. The other armor. wardens told me you'd found a promising recruit. I take it this is she? Allow me to introduce you, your majesty. No need, Duncan. You are Bryce's youngest, are you not? I don't think we've ever actually met. Ah, uh, yes, your majesty. My name is Natalia. Your brother has already arrived with High Ever's men. But we are still awaiting your father. Um... He's not coming. He died when our castle was taken. Dead? What do you mean? Duncan, do you know anything about this? Terran Kuzland and his wife are dead, Your Majesty. Arl Howe has shown himself a traitor and overtaken High Ever Castle. Had we not escaped, he would have killed us and told you any story he wished. Mm. I can scarcely believe it. Well, how could he think he could get away with such treachery? As soon as we are done here. I will turn my army north and bring Howe to justice. You have my word. Thank you, Your Majesty. No doubt you wish to see your brother. Unfortunately, he and his men are scouting in the wilds. Hmm. When will he return? Not until the battle is over, I fear. Until then, we cannot even send word. I apologize, but there's nothing more I can do. All I can suggest is that you vent your grief against the Darkspawn for the time being. Okay. Thank you, Your Majesty. I'm sorry to cut this short, but I should return to my tent. Loghain waits eagerly to bore me with his strategies. Your uncle sends his greetings and reminds you that Redcliffe forces could be here in less than a week. Ha! <laughs> Eamon just wants in on the glory. We've won three battles against these monsters, and tomorrow should be no different. I didn't realize things were going so well. I'm not even sure this is a true blight. There are plenty of darkspawn on the field, but alas, we've seen no sign of an archdemon. Disappointed, Your Majesty? I'd hoped for a war like in the tales. You know, a king riding with the fabled grave wardens against a tainted god. But I suppose this will have to do. I must go before Loghain sends out a search party. Farewell, grave wardens. She Wakanda what forever before true. Wakanda was They've forever. Won several battles against the Darkspawn here. Mm, let's see. Yeah, you don't sound very reassured. Despite the victory so far, the Darkspawn horde grows larger with each passing day. 
By now, they look to outnumber us. I know there is an arch demon behind this, but I cannot ask the king to act solely on my feeling. Hmm. Why not? He seems to regard the Grey Wardens highly. Yet not enough to wait for reinforcements from the Grey Wardens of Orlais. Hmm. He believes our legend alone makes him invulnerable. Our numbers in Ferelden are too few. We must do what we can and look to Terran Loghain to make up the difference. To that end, we should proceed with the joining ritual without delay. Okay. What do you need me to do? Feel free to explore the camp here as you wish. All I ask is that you do not leave it for the time being. There is another Grey Warden in the camp by the name of Alistair. When you're ready, seek him out and tell him it's time to summon the other recruits. Your hound can stay with me while I attend to some business. The Grey Warden tent is on the other side of this bridge. You will find us there should you need to. Okay, we've got a level up and uh, we've got some new codices and a whole new world to explore. What life will Natalie live now that her parents are gone? Her brother is somewhere out in the Kokiri Wilds fighting Darkspawn. And she has revenge on her mind. This is a new life for her. She's become a unwilling member now of the Grey Warden. So this ought to be interesting. All right, guys. Until next time, I have been Pixelated Twix. I will see you again here for another episode of Dragon Age Origins. Please let me know in the comments below if you are enjoying this uh, playthrough so far. And, uh, you know, give me some tips and tricks if you have any. Again, no spoilers. Um, yeah. All right. I will talk to you soon. Ciao.